Hello, I am Fantastic and Fantastic and today my hair is a little crazy and I am going to be rolling in the current Heroes and Fairies Pal Egg Machine. So if we take a look at what's currently available in the Egg Machine section, we'll see that there is the Gung Ho Pal Egg Machine and that's a pile of hot garbage. Stay as far away from that as possible. It's not worth your time. It's not even worth going through the motions of rolling and selling afterwards. It was good maybe several years ago, but sadly that is not the case anymore. Instead, you should be pulling the Heroes and Fairies Pallet Machine because if you look at the lineup, you'll see that the worst thing you could get is a Tamadra. Oh no, what was me, a Tamadra? Like, Tamadras are still probably useful for the majority of players, and if I'm not mistaken, many new players still burn through the thousand you get from the story mode from Odin, but that's just the way it is. Regardless of all that, you can acquire all these crystals, shards, watering cans, whatever it may be, and it's going to save you tremendous amounts of farming. So I'm just going to pull my whole load here, maybe, and even open up my Pal Egg Machine mail and just see what happens. So Tomaters are gold. We know that for sure. So it looks like the golds will be sad, but remember, these are nice. And while it is only like the little smaller like shards and cans, you have to remember that it's a five to one trade and it's saving you time. Like even in co-op, you might still get like say four, maybe five drops, let's say in a given run. I'm getting similar amounts to that now. And I'm getting big cans, less tamadras, bigger seed bags, a big crystal. This is incredibly valuable. That big crystal in the bottom right corner, that's where five little dinky shards. I just saved myself an entire run by just pulling. And I'm gonna keep pulling, just keep going. Like, this is a pretty magical pallet machine. Like, there is possibly going to be no reason for me to actually play the event dungeon if I continue to get fortunate rolls like this because I'm getting the nice stuff overall. This is great. This is much better compared to playing those dungeons. So, like, you can swipe them and, like, co-op. You can button them in solo mode. Like, there are ways to beat it. But rolling is always going to be the fastest solution. And remember, there was nothing better to spend your pallet machine points on like well that's a great outcome there big crystals bigger everything but like the other options will gung-ho collab there's no point and in all honesty i would just keep rolling this until it expires because it's going to save you so much time it's kind of annoying to farm they're probably better things you'd want to farm anyways on the other hand you can play through the daily arenas and they will give it they will drop the best things from there if i'm not mistaken i'm going to try and push my way through maybe i'll get a dark Mieta gem today we'll see how it goes later on but yeah like i said tamadras are the worst thing and again it's not too bad like i do have lots of tamadras but again many players may not so let's just keep enjoying the beautiful pal -like machine rolls oh yeah just good stuff all around just saving me so much time mm -hmm. So gold stuff has a chance to be, oh, that's too many Tamadras. But hey, it's a big red crystal, so it's still worthwhile. And I'm going to go and find my Palag Machine mail. Unfortunately, there's no open all option, so most of my mail is probably the gung-ho, like, 100 pal points, which is kind of silly. And I'm not going to just go through all of it. Let me just sort my pal points. Is there anything that's not just, like, a little dinky 100? I swiped the gung-ho collab quite a bit. I wish there was an open all button. Jeez. This is a terrible system. I'm not going to open all this up on screen for you, ladies and gentlemen. But the point of the matter is, you got to see some amazing Pallet -like Machine rolls. Like, it is definitely worthwhile to do so. Like, you should roll here. Like, there's nothing better to roll for your Pal points. Like, gung-ho collapse, stay away from it. And even if it rotates to something else, I would still use Heroes and Fairies because it saves you so much stamina and so much time farming those dungeons. You can do that. You can spend that time elsewhere. So, with that being said, hopefully you all have a truly fantastic day. I wish you all the best luck in your own pet adventures, and happy puzzling.